this is Miss Burks, and I wanted to make a quick video to tell parents about Class Dojo and how you and your child can log into Class Dojo at home to check on their classroom behavior. Um, so I'm going to start with a real quick introductory video, and then I'm going to show you how to create accounts and log in. Class Dojo is a tool that makes your classroom more fun, and it helps you become a better student. Your teacher will set up Class Dojo and make a list of actions to try to do this year like participating, helping others, and staying on task. When your teacher notices that you're doing these actions, you'll receive dojo points. And at the end of the day, you can find out how you've done. You can see what you're doing well, and also learn where you need improvement. The best part is this, you get your very own avatar. We'll give you one to start with, but you can make your own avatar once the teacher gives you your secret code. Log in at home using your secret code and you'll be able to make your own avatar. See how you did in class and see all your friends too. We hope you love using Class Dojo, like tons of students all around the world do. Now, your teacher will tell you more about how you're going to use Class Dojo in your classroom. Have fun! Okay, so your child will be coming home with this paper that looks something like this. Um, this is one first student who ended up not showing up for my class, so I'm just going to use it as an example and then I'm going to delete the class after I show you this demo. Um, it's going to have a student account code and also a parent account code. It says right here that you can actually download the app onto your uh, phone or your iPad or you can just go to the website which is what I'm about to show you. There's the uh, website right down there. Um, so I'm going to go to the classdojo.com and over here it says log in and if you're, you're going to help your child you're going to log in as a student. Now they don't have a username or password yet until they create one so you're going to go up right here where it says sign up with a code and you're going to enter that code that we just saw. So that student that we had was this. Okay, and they're going to be able to create a username. So I'm going to make one up. And that one's already used. All right, there we go. Okay, so when they have a username, you can create a password. Please make sure you. You, it's one that you and your child are going to remember. Um, definitely write this one down so that you can get on there again. Um, let's see. Sorry, my computer froze. What technology? Okay, so here's their account. There's that username I just made up. And push OK, I got it. The first thing they're going to be able to do is actually change their avatar. They can pick the shape, they can pick the color, they can pick eyes and the mouth, and I guess feet as well. Okay, and you can click save. You can always go back and change. Um, here it says even kids can invite their parents, so if you're sitting there with your child doing this, you actually can enter in your own email address right there. Um, what's really neat is, like I said, I was just playing around pretending with this kid, and so I've got, um, you can be, a, the kids can actually get on here and see how well they've done. If you notice here, is, the green is what they got points for, and it tells you even what categories. So this student would have been doing really well and working hard. And then you can see where they got in trouble. So maybe they were disrespectful, and this one says they're off task. Also, it breaks it down by day. It tells which teacher gave it to them, gave them or took away the points, and what day and time it happened. So the students can see how, much, how well they've been doing that week, and then they can always go up here where it says avatar and change their avatar again. And there's instructions for how to download it onto your phone or iPad. Okay, I'm going to log out as the student, and I'm going to try to log in as his parent. So I'm going to go back to Class Dojo. 
dot com. Um, like I said, there was also a parent code, so I'm going to go to log in as a parent. Um, let's see. Oh, you push sign up. Sorry. <laughs> uh, and here, parent account code. So I'm going to enter that code that I had for this student we made up. And you can see where you can put your first name, last name, your email address, and create a password for yourself. And then click submit. And what that's going to be able to do is you're able to have choices. You can actually, if you have it on your phone, you can get on there daily and see real time when your child gets points or has points taken away from them. Um, you can also get weekly reports from or to your email. It looks kind of similar to that pie chart we saw earlier that the kids can see. So this is awesome to let parents know where your child is struggling, but also where they are doing really well at. And it kind of helps you know what day and even down to the minute that they got those points, um, which can be really helpful for both parents and teachers. So that is Class Dojo. I hope you'll join me in signing up. Kids seem to really be excited about it. All right, thanks.